In this demo, we look at the file open feature in MapleSim for Modelica models. We will look at a simple Modelica model for nonlinear translational damper, use the file open to bring it into MapleSim, put it in a very simple model and simulate and then review the Modelica code within MapleSim. So what we see is a uh, editor for Modelica code. It's a typical um, model in Modelica. In the equation section, we will see the relationship between force and the relative velocity and the value d, which is an input, and that's the variable damping coefficient. In MapleSim, we can just go and simply open the MO file, as you can see. And when we do that, the model is created and a component goes under the project definition. And this component can be used in models alongside other components provided in various palettes. In MapleSim here, I create a simple model with a translational mass and apply the step force. And also I vary the damping coefficient using a sinusoid. And I probe the velocity of the moving mass simulation is done and we can look at the results the fluctuation as a result of changing the damping coefficient now we can go into maple sim and use the medelica code view feature here i'm gonna switch to medelica code view and select the nonlinear damper uh, subsystem and we will see similar code as the one we started with here in the equation section we will see the re relationship between the relative velocity as and the damping and the variable d which is the input to this component